ladies and gentlemen, welcome for another video here in beautiful Wildwood. And uh, today we're going to take a tour of the lighthouse. That's right, the Herfield Lighthouse. Now, uh, lately there's been an issue, and I don't know if you guys have ever noticed, but there's something wrong with the beacon. A couple weeks ago, the rotating beacon, the motor, broke down. And now the Coast Guard's responsible for maintaining that light, and so they replaced it with a blinking LED light, which I'll be honest with you, I'm old fashioned. I like the rotating light. And well, the Coast Guard, because they're the ones who run it, they're the ones who have to find the parts and fix it. So we're really hoping that the Coast Guard can pull the money together to get this bad boy back up to its rotating beacon. Because honestly, it looks so much better and it looks old fashioned. I mean, it's a Victorian style lighthouse. We want the rotating beacon. But uh, let's go inside and look around. We're going to start off what used to be the gift store, um, or I guess used to be the parlor. Now if you notice about this map, it's actually backwards. And that's because this was the press mat. They would put oil on here, on oil, they put ink on here, and then press it down on paper to give you maps like this. Kind of cool, right? check out the two bedrooms before we go all the way up. Well, we can't go all the way up because up there is still owned and uh, operated by the Coast Guard, but we can go and show you as much as we can. So here is something absolutely amazing, and I can't believe they actually have one here. So when you were sinking out in sea and they had to go ahead and save you, they were to get a line of rope and pull it from the life-saving station all the way out to your boat. And they would put this on a, um, what do you call that? Like on a zip line sort of kind of thing. And they would bring this to your boat and you would sit in here and they would pull you back to shore. It's really cool looking. Let me show you. Pretty cool, they actually have instructions on how to use it. Let me show you that real quick. So we're gonna go ahead and show you guys one of the other beacons they have here, which is on display. It looks really cool up front. And that just gives you the view where they can look at right here to look at the ships as they're coming in and out of the harbor. And then we're gonna continue upstairs. Right, so we're at the very top, well not the top of the lighthouse, because unfortunately upstairs where the beacon's at is ran by the Coast Guard. It's off limits, you're not allowed up there. 
but this is the highest you can go. And the view up here is spectacular. You can see everything from the life-saving station next door all the way down Wildwood. And of course, when the houses were a lot shorter, you could probably see all the way to Wildwood itself. But you can still see the, light, uh, the water towers and such, but let me show you around. It's hard to see because of the uh, the light, but that is the old life saving station. Um, we'll show you a little bit later, maybe in another video, but that used to go right into the ocean where the ramps used to be, but now there's a big wall there. But uh, yeah, let me try to zoom in so you can see. Mm -hmm. 